forgiveness is conditioned upon repentance. Forgiveness, biblically, is conditioned upon repentance. Now look at the text. Jesus says, if your brother sins, rebuke him. And if he repents, forgive him. And if he sins against you seven times in the day and turns to you seven times saying, I repent, you must forgive him. When Jesus speaks here, he is conditioning this forgiveness upon their repentance. If you read Matthew 18, when it talks about rebuking a brother privately, if they do not repent, it doesn't stop there. He doesn't say, well, just forgive them in your heart and overlook the matter. No, that sin is still there. It must be dealt with. He says there, if he repents, then you've won your brother. Then there's forgiveness. But you will not find in Scripture a blanket forgiveness that is not conditioned upon repentance. That repentance and forgiveness go together. Now some of you might be thinking of Jesus' words on the cross. When he's on the cross and he's being crucified and he says, Father, forgive them for they know not what they do. You think, well, there is a case where Jesus, out of love and compassion, forgives his persecutors and his enemies. You must remember, that was a prayer to the Father. Father, forgive these men who are crucifying me. We see the answer to that prayer in Acts chapter 2. Peter is on the steps of the temple in Acts chapter 2, and he preaches, and he says to those Jews who were there at Jesus' death, you crucified the Holy One. This one who has testified among you with his miracles, you crucified him. And it says there, they were cut to the heart. And they cried out to Peter, what must we do to be saved? And Peter said, repent and you will be forgiven of your sins. In other words, their forgiveness in answer to Jesus' prayer for forgiveness was conditioned upon their repentance. And when they repented, they were forgiven. You'll see many times in Scripture for us to forgive others as Christ has forgiven us. Ephesians 4.32 We are called to forgive others just as God in Christ forgave us. Colossians 3 We're called to love one another and forgive one another just as Christ has forgiven you. And how has Christ forgiven you? When did Christ forgive you? He forgave you when you were aware of your sin and when you confessed your sin and repented of your sin. The forgiveness of God is conditioned upon repentance. And that's the same kind of forgiveness that we're called to give, conditioned upon repentance.